Hello and welcome back to Baldur's Gate Dark Alliance. We are going out west where I belong. <laughs> A pretty little chick wherever you go. And I walk and they walk. Yeah, and then we're gonna go east. And there's no good song about the east. But here's a good song for you. Oh, you can drink your fancy ales, you can drink them by the flagon. But the only brew for the brave and true comes from the green dragon. Brave and true that was. I kind of said crave by accident because my mouth is, how do you say, mm -hmm, stupid? Yes, that is what I am telling you. Again, I love repetition. You could drink your fancy ales, you could drink them by the flagon, but the only brew for the brave and true comes from the green dragon. Well, this is a convoluted western cliff. But what we're doing here, we gotta go west and east and find dwarves that have the tinder needed to light the signal fire to melt the dwarf that's in ice to get the key to the mine. That is what the dude said, and this is one huge dude. They have a cave troll. Oh, you went down like nothing. You got nothing but a loincloth. Ain't nothing but a loincloth. Dangling by your groin. It's a dead end, man. The way is shut. It is made by those who are dead, and the dead keep it. The way is shut. See, Nintendo Capri Sun is full of Star Wars quotes. I'm full of Lord of the Rings quotes. Listen, guy. You got some green hair. And a pot belly pig. Why do they put an apple in the pig's mouth when they do, a, like, a pig barbecue thingy? Is it to give it flavor? Is it decoration? I didn't rent it shoes, dude. It's not taking your turn. I have a sneeze that stuck. It might subside. 8,702 coins. Boy, if only we could just get that from the local vending machine. Put in a quarter, get $8,000. It makes sense to me. Because it's all made up anyway, and it is so stupid, stupid. Hey, I didn't know they could freeze their, themselves. Throw another blizzard rock. I see you got a rock there. And you got antlers. Just go down, man. I don't know where is forward and where is back. I was feeling down and desperate. So I went to the cupcake store and I asked for a vanilla cupcake. And they said, oh, we don't have vanilla cupcakes. That's Thursday. We have Kuna. <laughs> Stupid. But it makes me laugh. And that's what it's all about is how many times you chuckle. Where's that statistic? My pack won't hold anymore. My diaper's full. I'm carrying too much. 
I'm carrying too much. You know what? I'm actually pretty happy that I don't think for the rest of my time on this planet will I ever have to change a diaper. Because ain't no way I'm gonna have a kid. Not at the rate we're going. I'm carrying too much. I can't even pick up these arrows. They're really light in the pouch, but... We have... I'm carrying too oh, much. come on. All right. I got an idea. Watch this. There you go. Look at that. That was called using your thinker. Quit playing with your dinker. I'll never forget that when I was like learning to bathe myself and shower. You know, like no longer taking baths and just like showering myself like a normal human. My dad one time, he was like, did you wash everything? And I was like, yeah. He was like, did you get everything? You got under your arms and you got your dinker? <laughs> what? Who says that? And that was just yesterday. No, that that was, uh, I don't know how old I was. At what age do you transition from the bathtub to the shower? It varies from person to person, and that's what makes your intelligent quotient. No, I don't know. Could you imagine that? If that dictated intelligence... How early you transition from the bathtub to the shower? I don't know what the heck I'm talking about. Everything looks the same here. But, you can drink your fancy ale. You can drink them by the flagon. I like that word, flagon. But the only brew for the brave and true comes from the green dragon. Yes! What do we got? Eight points. Eight! Ocho! Flame arrows. 25 to 34. Mm-hmm. Uh, endurance. Ooh. That costs four, though. Death blow. Death blow. Ground claw. I'm thinking flame arrows, man. And then we have two points for... Hmm. Nah, that's stupid. Combat reflexes! Yes! Increase your attack rate slightly. There we go. Now we're gonna be swinging awful fast. Did we notice a difference? I don't know. Hey man, you gonna be throwing rocks? I will hit you in the beer belly. Now why is there a save station here? Because this mountain is convoluted? It's 3 a.m. I must be lonely. It's not 3 a.m. yet, but it's getting close.
Yeah, we're going to Surf City. Oh, my pack won't. My pack won't hold it. In that case, a diversion. Or an intermission. Here we go. Oh, Branock the dude. Scimitar. Swords, axes, hammers. Swords. We have more than enough weapons for everyone. A ring. Man, that constitution would have been uh, gold, you've come pretty to the right good. Place, traveler. How can I help you? Um, well, 93, now that's not enough. Let's particular. get more arrows. Never will you see such fine steel as you will in this shop. So That's one potion, right? When you recall and then recall back, that's one. It's like a double use thing. Hey, there was a potion here, man. What happened? You guys remember Puff the Magic Dragon? Sesame Street that had that one. Oh no, it was Eureka's Castle. Remember Eureka's Castle? It had that like dinosaur dude with the blanket and stuff moved on the blanket. Ice cave with a save. Nah, let's just press on. Although, we've been pretty happy, so it would be a shame to lose this commentary with a game over. You have entered the Wampa Nest. You are now entering the lair of the great spider. Hey, that's a dwarf. That's what we're looking for. What is that? Something pooped out. Flint. Alright. So we got the flint. We gotta find the rest of the dwarven party. What else do you need to light a signal fire? Bring wood and oil. Denethor's losing his mind! He's burning Faramir alive! Quickly! This way! You know that scene in Lord of the Rings when Denethor's biting into the tomato as, like, the army's dying? <laughs> it's so gross. <laughs> But it's good acting to eat so sloppily as a, like, depiction of death. I just really love Lord of the Rings. You know there's a Game Boy Advance Lord of the Rings game that I had? That was a lot like this. It, like this isometric camera kind of thing. But I never beat it. I never even, like, got off of Moria because Moria was, like... Eight stages long. What do we got here? Mm -hmm. uh -huh. Padded armor.
Rejuvenation. How awesome would it be if there was a potion that gave you your vitality back? That made you feel like 18 again. The young again potion from The Sims. Alright. That was nuts, man. The western... Whatever. Summit, I guess? Well, they're out there having fun in the warm California sun. Dun, dun, dun. Let's save our game like a dope. That song's weird. But it always comes to mind whenever I see the word West. Just going out west where I belong. Good chicka bong bang 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 bucking de bong. That's what it says. Now we're going out east. At dawn, look to the east. But yeah, there's a part in that going out west song. What what the California Sun is what it's called. But he's like a pretty little chick wherever they go. And then he's like, oh, and I walk, and I walk. <laughs> he just like whines and moans or something. I don't know what you call that. Oh, that's a bunch of trash from 20 years ago going over their heads like a dope elevation. Actually, I guess I should be impressed. No. No, I shouldn't. Hey, we're leaving the snow. Four hobbits? Devil called me by name. Down, down, down. Hanging on at the back of a train. Tom Waits has some outstanding lyrics. And it's just funny. I don't know, it's fun, I guess, to sing like him, or to try to. It rips your throat apart, though. 120 arrows. Do we really not have anything to sell? Oh, we got... That's still nothing. Are we carrying that many potions? Oh, we have 23 big chunks. I always thought the red potion in Mario Brothers 2 looked tasty, and that's what these potions remind me of. Like, it looks like a nice cherry 7-up or something. Arrows. He's not even saying his line anymore. Where's my, my pack is full. Hey. Hey. You want to dance? Let's go. of trouble with the items right now keen masterwork those words sound good surely there's got to be something better than this morning star eventually it'd be nice to ditch this 12 pound thing let's recall and take a look 
in a book, The Reading Rainbow. You're a reading rainbow. If Shut you up. feel the need to part with your gold, you've come to the right place, traveler. Oh, that actually took a lot off. Oh, because the one one thing was a shield, wasn't it? How can I help you? Well, uh... are you looking for anything in particular? Not for 20 PSI. That's a deep cut from my life. I'm not even going to begin to explain where that comes from. It would be too much work and not funny at all. <laughs> so... I'm carrying too much. I can't even possibly pick up a pebble. Anyway, let's see what this dwarf over here has. This looks important. Torch. So we have flint and a torch. And that other guy gave us a flask. We did pick up a recall potion as soon as we used it, so this is not really a waste. Never will you see such fine steel as you will in this shop. Holy crap! Wait! Yes, I will ditch two pounds for better defense. More than enough weapon. Going back to Leather Helmet, plus five. That's crazy. We're doing pretty well on the gold, too. Maybe at the end of this episode, we can peruse his shop and see if uh, there's anything worth buying. Our armor is pretty good right now. I'm blowing this up. Yeah, I like the explosion. Explosion. Okay, well, the east was so much easier than the west. Wait a minute, why are there wolves down there? There's more to the map. Find members of Colgrim's party. Is there another dwarf here? No, that's just the wall, a mountain wall. So there's wolves across the lake, but nothing else, I think, is what to gather from that. All right, so... What the heck are we walking into when we light the signal fire? So we can end things off now and proceed north up the summit next time, or we could just do that right now and see what happens. Either way, I think I'm going to stop by the save. Burning eyes. What? You guys like jasmine rice? Jasmine rice with a fried egg is uh, kind of good. Not all the time, though. Sometimes it's a little bit too sweet. The peak. There better not be an ice dragon up here like the dude was alluding to. What is that thing? What is that? Hey, man! Ow, ow!
Holy crap! What the heck are these things? Are, can you kill them? That's a dead end. I did not like that. Another dwarf. Like the signal tower. You still need the oil flask. What? Did we not pick it up from that guy? Hold on. I'm loading that previous save after burning through all those potions. He's right there at the foot of the mountain. Remember, uh, we talked to that guy and I was like, where's the flask? And it wasn't in my inventory and I didn't know... So if it's in that cave, I'm going to feel real stupid that I walked right by it. Sure enough. That's bad design, though. They should have auto-given it to you right after the dialogue ended. Yeah, like, that that's what they should have done. Not plop it on the floor where you can barely see it and easily miss it. Like, it was glowing. It had a blue border around it in a blue environment. <laughs> So it's not like it was even highlighted, it was camouflaged. Let's save and get through this madness again. Get out of here with nonsense. I'm gonna whack you with the club. Yim, yim. My gosh! Okay, good thing we saved. We still gotta sit through a load screen, though. And do you know what this dwarf has to say about that? And then he says something in the black speech or whatever. I don't remember what he- I don't know how to say it. Get out of here! Holy good lord on toast. What is this? Bad design. Can't even kill these things. God. We better not have to fight a dragon now after all that. The beacons are lit! Gondor calls for aid. He's not alive, right? <laughs> No bounce or anything. I guess he is frozen. Hey, I was going to investigate him. That guy's got a key on him. Oh, no. It's Chili Billy. Or is it Chili Willy? Which one's the ice one from Banjo-Tooie? Come on, Eileen. Oh. Something, something. 
Well, this is gonna be fun. Let's hope those flame arrows found something. Okay. Where is this beast? Get out of here. Stay away from me, you stupid orbs. What did I just say? What? Oh, 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 I should have just used a recall potion. What am I doing? That could have all been avoided. I should have just recalled it right as soon as we got the key. I just burned through potions like an idiot, but maybe it'll be good for our carrying capacity. I don't know. Extra gloves. How can I help you? Hmm. We I could have a better weapon. Do you have a better weapon? What do you have in here? Fine steel as you will in this shop. So what is the ultimate thing? Masterwork great sort of speed. That's a beast of a thing with a lot. Of, oh, it's, it's 15 pounds though Mithril scimitar plus two 21 to 27 and we can afford it and it's only four pounds Hey Why not? Time for a change. Get rid of that 12 pound thing. How can I help you? And that will help our carrying capacity, plus our weapons better now. And well, isn't that so nice? Cool, man. All right, well, that's an episode there. I don't know what happened to the dragon. I'm assuming we're going into the mine next, unless I severely missed something. But I wish I recalled sooner, though. Oh, well. Thanks for watching, you guys. I'll uh, see you next time. Take care.